if we do this, as you can see, the quest did stop. Um, I didn't get anything because. Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Waz, and today I'm going to be showing you how to complete the new Thin Ice quest in Build War for Treasure. So as you can see, this quest actually gives you 1,000 gold and 100 snow blocks, and that's very good because 1,000 gold is very good if you're just starting out, and it's actually very easy and very cheap to complete this quest. So this is probably one of the best quests to get yourself some gold. So yeah, that's really all I have to say, so without any further ado, let's get straight into it. Alright guys, to start things off, let's go ahead and start the quest real quick. There we go, just like that. Okay, there we go. We start the quest. There's, there should be a giant fan spinning over there. So what we're going to do to start this off is turn off anchor block and then place a chair on the ground just like this. As you can see, anything you place will turn to ice and that makes it very weak. That makes it about one hit, I'm pretty sure. So you want to avoid the rocks as much as you can. But anyways, we're going to sit in this chair and then place a glue block directly on top of the chair. And then get out a hinge and just place the hinge uh, facing inwards, so basically like that. And it should be on the glue block like this. And now you should be able to delete the chair, and if you hold W, you will go up. But you may be wondering how you control this. So if you're on a PC here, you're just going to go ahead and turn on Shift Lock. And then when you press Shift on your keyboard, you should be able to control this thing. But if you're not on PC, if you're on mobile or something... Uh, all you have to do is zoom in, and as you can see, you can turn this thing, uh, and that's how you do it on mobile, so this does work on mobile. Anyways, once you have this built, you're gonna go ahead and fly over to this black wall. Now, you want to make sure you go through the first black wall, but only go through the first one, because, uh, you don't need to go through any of the other ones. Actually, you know what, before we do that, I actually wanna go back and grab ourselves a pink candy. So, if you have candy, I highly recommend, uh, eating candy, because it will really speed up the process. So just, I'm just going to go ahead and eat the pink candy that is, uh, I, I guess it turned to ice, so it'll be uh, chilly. But anyways, eat the candy, and as you can see, we're going much faster. So anyways, we're just going to fly into this wall. So we're going to fly through this wall, and it shouldn't break. Um, if it does break, that means that this is actually patched. Uh, I don't know. You Right now it works, and it's been this glitch has been in the game for a very long time. So anyways, once you go through that first black wall, all you have to do is fly up through the ceiling... And um, you should be above the stages. Now that you're actually above the stages, you just go straight back. Uh, make sure you're high enough to like go over the bigger ones. But as you can see, we are just flying over the stages, and it's just very easy to um, actually get to the end. So we're just going to fly to the end now. The reason we went through that first black wall is it won't actually register unless you go through one black wall. Uh, the end, the, You won't actually be able to redeem it if you don't go through that first black wall. I don't know why that's kind of like an anti it just makes it so you so you're uh you can't do what we're doing right now but it doesn't really work very well so you just have to go through one black wall and that's it so anyways you're just gonna go ahead and fly over to the end just like i am here and then once you're positioned right above the end just click the butter block it should disappear and you should be able to fall right down to the end just like that and then just walk towards the treasure and um since i already completed this quest i don't think i'm gonna get anything but um, if we do this, as you can see, the quest did stop. Um, I didn't get anything because I already completed the quest on this account. But this does work. Uh, as you can see, I got all the gold and the gold block. And yeah, so the, and the quest did stop itself, which means that we would have gotten stuff if, uh, if, we, if I hadn't completed this quest before. But if it's your first time doing this quest, it should work. And yeah, that's really all I have to say for this video, guys. Hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.